Luke, thank you so much for coming and, and, and being a role model for Wear Your Label. It means not only the world to us, but to our customers and our followers who, who, who know you, Luke McMaster from McMaster and James. Back and in the day, yeah. Yeah, that's so exciting. It's my, it's my pleasure. I love what you guys are doing. When did you first see that you know, reducing stigma around mental illness and, and people living effect, or who are affected by mental illness as something that was important to you and uh, the work that you do? Well, it's something I've always been interested in, partly because uh, I, have, uh, I have three brothers and two of them happen to be psychiatrists. I remember coming home one day, uh, or actually going by my brother's house, there was a homeless person asking for, for a change and I, I, you know, I kind of walked by him and you know, maybe the judgment meter was a little bit on that day. And I went to my brother's house and I was like, yeah, this, this homeless guy was asking for change and he's always there and I, I've given him money before, but I didn't give him money today because I think he's just gonna spend it on, on alcohol or something. And my, my brother's like, wait, 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 wait. And he got very passionate all of a sudden. He's like, you don't, everyone has a story, man. And you don't know what it's like and you don't know what people go through in their journey. Even in my own family, my immediate family, there have been some, some major uh, dealings with uh, mental health and addiction issues. And I see not only the effect that it has on the person that has the addiction, but the collateral effect it has. And how lucky we are in my family that we support each other and we encourage each other and, and hopefully try to open up those dialogues. It's like this invisibility complex. So when we're walking in Toronto, or we're walking in these larger cities, we start to notice a little bit less every time the people that are, on, that are homeless, that are, that are, that are panhandling, that are mm -hmm. asking for change, mm -hmm. and they start to become invisible. Mm -hmm. There is a lot of guilt, there is a lot of shame, and there's a lot of vulnerability attached to that, but it's something that, you know, I'm trying to challenge others, is to, you know, walk by and, and you know, because it's not about offering money. Like if you don't have money to offer, offer a conversation or mm -hmm. offer a question or offer empathy. I've had little tastes in my own life of like panic attacks, anxiety attacks. And uh, you know, just having just a taste of it, you just understand maybe on a small level, the, the saying that my mom had that was just like the simplest, most old, old fashioned saying, you know, walk a mile in their shoes. I remember talking to a guy and you know, just since, since my brother reprimanded me and, um, we kind of created the hashtag or want to create the hashtag judgment clouds judgment and that just came from starting that conversation. Mm. Ways that we can approach this, you know, mental illness is an invisible illness. That's why we use clothing as a symbol for people to see, uh, for the world to see that we're, yeah. you're hurt but you're healing. Yeah. But if I wear something, right, so the conversation goes from one on one to one on the world yeah. or one on the world that you experience and that's yeah. what's really cool. And and the more people that we can encourage with our conversations and our clothing and the work that we do, the, the more comfortable and visual mental illness can be. So thank you so much for coming today. It's been fantastic, man. Like, very articulate, very well spoken about mental illness and mental health. And I think that's one of the biggest challenges that we find is people don't feel like they're going to say the right thing. It's, it's honestly, it's something that uh, I'm, I'm really passionate about it, and I'm passionate about getting to know more about it. Just need a little mouth to mouth.